Hi guys and welcome again to another Bump Box special and this time it's Candy and we're back on Mystery Eggs and this time it's Super Mario and Frozen. First time I've seen these, um, basically in the import shops, the only place I can find these and I've been selling out every single time. I managed to get Elsa and Anna this time. Um, don't know if there's any specific differences or anything. Um, the only thing I can find is this one rattles, this one doesn't. So maybe this egg is dead. So maybe there'll only be a chick in this one. Maybe it's the other way around. I forget. I've slept since I bought these. However, though, very excited. I don't know if these are going to be decent chocolate. It's not really much by way of um, packaging or anything. It just says um, Zaini or Zaini. Um, that's about it. And they're very bewildered. Not to free child there. Uh, it's looking very pensive. As if to say, I don't know whether I should eat this or not. Um... Pfft, nothing really much to say. It's frozen, so therefore you have to spend a million T pounds just to buy this. Um, go on, let's rip in. Nothing too much interest really here. I'm hoping it might be actually a decent figurine rather than some sort of rubbishy, stupid toy. Um, I think I paid about one pound each for these, or just under one pound. And uh, oh, not like a Kinder Egg where you get the two sets of chocolate uh, bl blended together. There's no um, white chocolate inside, it's just all milk. Um, let's try a little bit. Snap, snap. It's nice enough chocolate. Um, it's not a brand name like Nestle or Cadbury's or anything like that. It's just a bit generic. But um, it tastes like um, generic Easter Egg chocolate, if that makes any sense. Just, um, just a bit samey. And inside, we've got one of the little troll people. There we go. And what have we got? Uh, wow. So you could get some little charms of all the main characters, or you could get some little figurines. And we've got the figurine of the troll, basically. Um... The only rubbish looking figurine. <laughs> uh, wow, thanks very much. Um, obviously Elsa on her hands. Only Sven Charm. Bit odd. Olaf, for me, probably looks the best there. Um, obviously if you've got a Frozen fan in the family, it'd um, be great fun collecting these. They'll, they'll genuinely do seem nice enough little things. Um, uh, I don't think the charms would be much fun. They haven't even got any um, string or anything on them, so you've, you've just basically got a little hook to charm for them. Yeah, so we've got a little uh, little troll. Um, Quality-wise, uh, paint job's good. Um, Disney registered item, but um, yeah, it's a, I don't know. It's it's nice enough, but I wouldn't I wouldn't go uh, crazy about the thing. See what else has got inside. All right, she's not doing anything. Come on. What are you betting it'll be one of those stupid charms now I've put them down? Come on. Open. Oh, solid. Oh, should we try some more chocolate? Maybe it's improved. No, still doesn't taste very good. And we have got... Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, still the same things to collect. And we have got... Ugh. Great. One of the rubbish charms. Ugh. Uh, I mean, I'd, I don't know, I mean, it's just a little really rubbishy, flimsy bit of, I mean, just a little rubbery, plasticky chunk, it's, yeah, I mean, it looks alright, but I mean, come on, for a pound, I mean, a <laughs> uh, bit, bit, not, bit not sure about those, however, however, Nintendo, we're hoping are going to pull this together, we've got some click figurines over there, and also some Super Mario mystery eggs, sweets and surprises. I'm hoping it's not going to be like the surprise bags I did about a week ago, where it's just a generic tat in a bag, and now they've put it into an egg. Um, we'll see. Uh, Luigi Mario, sweets and surprises. Nintendo registered, and it's by Bomb Bomb Buddies. So yet again, brush your apple and run after it. Nothing really changes there. And this, if we know anything, it will be full of e-numbers. Oh. Ooh. What have we got? Oh. A Powerball. Everybody likes Powerballs. Oh. Ooh. That's quite nice. Um. Oh. Yeah, that's, that's nice enough. 
It's a uh, little toadstool mushroom, obviously, but um, yeah, it'd have been nice to actually had like maybe Wario or something a bit random, but um, yeah, I don't think it'd be going into Smash Brothers stuff, but that's that's nice enough. Um, it bounces, hooray! And we've got stars. These are going to be very cheap and nasty. Um, you can just tell they look chalky and dusty, and um, they don't look like they'll be very nice. Should we put some in our egg? There we go. Let's try one. Ooh, that one looks particularly nasty. I'll have that one. Nah. Uh, yep. Cheap. Sticking to my teeth. Yeah. Not very good. Tastes generic strawberry, very light. Like toothpaste, really. A little sticker there of all the gang. Nah. Uh, Anything we can stick that to. There we go. Ah. ah. Better already. And what's this? Oh, a bit of paper to tell us the things we could have got. Uh, power balls. They do look the best things, to be honest. Um, nothing really cool there. Whistles, charms, stickers. Collect them. I mean, you wouldn't really want any of those, really. I think the power ball... A bouncing ball is probably the best thing you can get out of there. Um, overall, pretty chuffed with that. Um, be nice if it was different sweets. We've got a serrated edge on this one. Oh, no. Just gonna have to go for the old fashioned rip. The eggs are actually probably the nicest thing here. It's actually um, something decent, I suppose, it has been put in. Oh, and we've got one of the little keychains by the look of that. Have another one. Yep. Still tastes horrible. Oh, yeah, not feeling that to be honest. Feels a uh, cheaper quality than the um, the frozen one to be honest. I mean, look at the face on the bag. It's like uh, nobody wants this. I mean, who? No one's going to stick that to their keys. No one's going to collect that. That's <sighs> wow. And this time, a sticker of Luigi waving going, Ha ha, ripped you off. Ha ha ha, hey. Sure have, Luigi. And yet again, wow, load of rubbish. Now, these look good. They've got a mechanism so you can fire these and it can be lethal. You fill it up and you ping the back of Mario's head and you can knock out someone. Not suitable for children under three due to the small parts. Store in a cool and dry place. Please retain these details. Da, da, da. Do not aim at the eyes or face. Ah, oh, damn. Well, that's my weekend's fun gone. Please wash this product thoroughly before use. What? I'm supposed to take it into a bath or something? Stick it in a dishwasher? Why does it need to be washed thoroughly? I mean, is this in case children try and stick Mario's head in their mouth? I mean, it, it just dispenses sweets. So they've given us something that's not clean to use or to dispense sweets? That's a bit odd. Um... Not to uh, convince... Well, I'm going to risk it. I'm not going to wash it. <gasps> I'm a rebel. There we go. Take it, Mario. Uh, Mario. And it's awesome. Uh, well, like a Pez dispenser, you've got a massive chunky head. Um, it, it, it does look like Mario. It's nice enough. Obviously, it's Nintendo registered. It says Nintendo all over it. Click, click, click. We get it. It's click, click, click. Understand. And we've got two bags of these little... Oh, some sweets. Stick the candy roll in. So you have to open up his head, fill him in. All right. Open, open, open. All right. Oh, see how many I can get out. Come on, Mario. Mario, Mario. All right. See if I can get. I've left up the uh, 1 to 10 range of our blind bag figures. And I'm going to see if Mario has got any range. I'm about two foot away here. I'm going to see if the old click thing is actually warranted to say not for eyes and face. We're going to see if there's any actual impact on this. All right. That's test. Oh, oh, oh. Nearly. Oh, come on. Ah, oh, didn't get anyone. Oops. Nah, rubbish. But, yep, it has got some impact behind it. Quite impressed. Um, I suppose I'd best try some of the sweets. I'll go for a blue candy roll. Crunchy, dusty. It tastes like um, icing sugar, really. It's, it's just a sweet, sugary powder that's compressed into a disc. <laughs> Nothing much more to say about that. This time we've got a very glum-looking Donkey Kong. There's a 
I'm Donkey Kong. <sighs> now they've stuck my head on this. Oh, it just looks very depressed. It's just not happy at all. Not the chirpy looking Kong there. And it's Link. He doesn't look very happy either. Yet again, not for the eyes or face. Well, sorry lads. Going to try and get Master Chief and the old Red Ranger there. Come on. Let's see if we can actually smash some stuff off. Come on. Want some uh, impact here. Open up Kong. Hungry, hungry, hungry. I believe these were £1 each. So about the same price as the Super Mario eggs, 80p. Really, that was probably too much. And uh, the frozen eggs, just under a pound. And uh, these were also a pound. So arguably, this is, I think, the most cost-effective thing. You're getting a nice thing to keep afterwards. The candy roll sweets are easy enough to get anywhere to refill. And they're nice enough collectible things. They're just uh, giant heads. There's Luigi, Link, Donkey Kong, Mario in the range. They're quite nice. Um, well, yeah. It'd be nice, though, if we can actually smash some stuff up with them. See if Kong's got a bit more uh, power in him. Come on, Kong. Come on. Come on. Hey, well done, Kong. Well, in review, mystery eggs. Probably stick to Kinder Eggs, really. Maybe wait till Kinder Eggs get the licensing to do proper frozen Kinder Eggs. Because these zany ones are all right. But, I mean, do people really want this? Just a... Uh, look at my face. It's bent. Uh. In review, don't bother. Wait till proper licensed frozen things come out. Maybe a massive Kinder Egg or something will be done soon. Anyway, remember to like and subscribe. Until next time, bye!